Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my Ipsy and my BoxyCharm unboxing videos. I know I'm uploading this really late in the month just because I received them really late in the month because of like the whole Labor Day thing and they didn't start shipping them out until after Labor Day and then I didn't go to the mail forever and then now I've just had them sitting in my room for a few days and I just wasn't sure whether or not I wanted to film this video but here I am doing this unboxing for you guys and I hope you enjoy it. So we're going to be starting off with Bucket Charm. I'm going to let you guys know I already opened both of these. I already know what is in these. I just really wanted to film this video. So, in the BoxyCharm, there is this hair girt. It's like a soothing yogurt for your hair. It's um, a smoothing yogurt hair mask made with yogurt protein, prebiotics, quinoa, a botanical oil blend, and bio-keratin. And this is $11. And help tame unruly, frizzy, and dry hair. This is really cool. Definitely going to be using this when I take a shower later on. Yeah. Anything that helps my hair. It's wonderful. Okay. So next we have this Butter London Nail Lacquer in the color Yummy Mummy. <laughs> That's such a great name. Okay, um, it's full size and this retails for $15. It's like a really pretty brownish color. I'm not really into that type of color for my nails. I usually like going like darks or like really really light but I don't like like nude colors for my nails I love nude colored lipsticks that's about it <laughs> I don't like nude colors for my nails it's just I don't know I've never really been into it okay next we have this pure her I don't know how to pronounce this but it's um hydrating lip lacquer in the color mystic like Pokemon Go Hmm. Why is that the first thing I thought of? Okay. So I already, like, did a little spinning thingy. Because I was literally sitting there for, like, 20 minutes trying to get the product out. And it just... Anyways. Here is the lipstick color. It's a really pretty, like, purplish pink color. I don't know. It's really nice. And this is also full size. Everything in this box is full size. Like everything from Box of Charm always comes full size. Um, this retails for $22. It's in like a really pretty, just like a silver tube. It's great. Okay, so next we have the Hikari eyeliner in the color Raven. And this is just like a regular eyeliner, like. I already used it, so it's not it's not as sharp anymore. You guys can see it. There you go. Um, it's just a regular black eyeliner. Yeah, just like that. Just regular black eyeliner. I mean, you can never have too many black eyeliners. Like I love, 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 love black eyeliner because. You know, I have a lot of eyeliners, like in a lot of different colors, and I mostly just use the black ones. But it's just me. Okay. Oh, and that re that eyeliner retails for thirteen dollars. Damn. Okay. And lastly, we have the Studio Makeup On The Go Eyeshadow Palette. And I use this today to create this look that I have going on right now. It's this palette. Really pretty. As you can tell, the colors that I used today was this one. It doesn't have the names of the colors. Anyways, I used this like white, like, it's like a goldish white looking. The color in the middle, this color, and this color. I used basically half of the colors in here to create this look and I really like this. It's really pigmented. It's great. 
but I accidentally like shoved my brush in too hard on the wet one because no product was coming off and then I was like what the heck and I like went really hard and then it just like a chunk of it came off so <laughs> I'm upset about that anyways this on the go eyeshadow palette is $49.95 that's really expensive well for me anyways <laughs> So, the total amount for this box was, I don't even know, I don't have a calculator on me, um, it was a lot. I did the math the other day, I think it was like $110, but I don't remember honestly. Um, I'll just put the price in right here, just let you guys know the real price once I figure it out. Okay. Next, we are going to go with Ipsy. So, the bag this month is really cute. It's just like a dark grayish with like silver sparkles and then like four girls dancing and it's like white and gold. It's really, really pretty. I really like this bag. Okay. So, first off, we have the Ulta 3 Nail Color in Sizzling Red. This is more like something I would wear, like red nail polish all the way, every day. Could always wear red nail polish. Okay, so next we have this Bella Pierre Cosmetics Mineral Blush in the cutter and the cutter in the color Autumn Glow. <laughs> and um, I already like took the little like sticker thingy off that keeps it from like all coming out, so it's like everywhere now. But, um, let's just, oh, this is so pretty. It looks more of like a, you guys see it? It's like right there. It's like right here. I don't know if you can see it. I don't think you can see it. But, um, it's a really pretty color. It's like a, can you see it? It's like that brownish color. It's really pretty. I really like that. Anyways. Next in here, we have the Briogeo. I don't know how to pronounce that. But it's a deep conditioning mask for your hair, I think. Yeah, it's for your hair. Um, it's supposed to reduce breakage by up to, up to 81% after three uses. Three uses? Three uses? Hmm. But... <laughs> This looks like it can only last. This looks like it could only last like not that many uses. <laughs> Especially if you have longer hair. I mean, this is a really small tube, but I have a lot of like deep conditioning products just because my hair like I dyed it blonde, so my hair like totally dyed. And I've just really been struggling with like the blonde part is so dead. Then like my brown part, which is my natural hair, it's like really soft and really like full of life basically. And then it's like you touch the blonde part and it just feels like hay. Like it's so bad. Like I honestly regret dyeing my hair blonde like so much. I mean don't get me wrong, I looked really good with blonde hair. But I just, would I do it again? No. <laughs> okay. So next we have the Tartiest Lash Paint Slash Mascara. Basically it's the Tarte brand mascara. Um, so I was really confused on how to open this when I first got it. So what you do is you just no now I can't open it. But um you just you can open it. Okay. So you kinda like twist and then pull up. But, like, I totally thought I broke it at first because, like, when you open it, it's just, like, it starts off like this. Like, it totally looks like you broke it. And then it's, like, the wand. But I just, I got so freaked out. I was like, I broke it already. Like, I haven't even used it. And I literally, I told my mom, I was like, I don't know what I did wrong. And then she, like, she, like, I gave it to her like this. And then she just, like, pulls it up. And she's like... You can just open it like that. And I was like, oh. <laughs> I was like so confused. <laughs> but yeah. And lastly, in the empty bag, 
is this Pixie by Petra lipstick in the color Rose Natural. This is a really, really tiny, tiny lipstick. Like, look at this compared to my hand. Like, that's tiny. But this color is really, really nice. Like, it's a really pretty, like, rosy color. Look at that. That's, that's this one. But it's so pretty, like, this type of lipstick, that is my favorite color. Obviously, I'm not wearing that color today. Today, I am wearing Pillow Talk from ColourPop. And Pillow Talk is literally my favorite song from Zayn. Well, it's like one of my favorite songs from him because he's great. But um, this lipstick color is also great. It's just... Okay, I bought it. The package, it looks brown. I thought it was going to be like a brownish color. But then you put it on your lips and it's like a gray. Like it's totally misleading. But anyways, that was my Ipsy and my BoxyCharm. Let me know if you guys have these subscriptions. I, sometimes I feel like I make these and it's like, I don't know if you guys want to watch them. If you don't want to watch them, like let me know what you think down below. Comment. And um, make sure you like my video, subscribe, and all that jazz. <laughs> Be notified for other videos I post. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!